Good morning from Mauritius. It is our first, first morning in Mauritius and yeah, it's a bit of a surprise we are now here. It was actually on our bucket list for a very, very long time. Um, we had planned to go and then the pandemic situation came so we didn't go and finally is the time that we are here. We will spend about two and a half, three weeks here in Mauritius and our first stop is down here in Mahibu. This is in the very, very south. It's very close to the airport. So uh, we arrived yesterday after a pretty nice flight. We flew with Edelweiss, it's a Swiss airline, and very comfortable, very easy. 11 hour flight, straight direct from Switzerland, and we came here in the warmth. But uh, talking about warmth, it's nice and warm, of course, it's about 24 degrees, but it's pretty windy, so I hope you will hear me nicely. And we had a lot of rain yesterday, um, yeah. but now I would say first let's go and find a place to have breakfast and then we will explore a little bit of the beach around here, that means we go to Blue Bay and Juan's Disney and afterwards we will check out Mahibu. It is a tiny, cute little town here. It has quite some charm. And yeah, we will walk around the waterfront and the center, look where we can find a supermarket or some fruit stands to get some supplies. Okay, I would say let's start the day. On the road to really explore and especially to reach all the hidden corners we have hired a car hiring a car in Mauritius is pretty affordable we paid about 20 euros per day plus the gas and the car was delivered to the airport and the length of the hiring was two and a half weeks it was pretty easy but the car was in a terrible state so subscribe to the channel later on you will see how terrible it was we had some issues with it and finally here we are at Blue Bay in Mauritius famous to go snorkeling uh, it's supposed to be one of the top spots for snorkeling and diving and it's really nice I'm here on a beach with um, some volcanic rocks it's black the sea is blue and behind me you see the reef and further behind the waves are crashing it's really nice it's very special but the water to be honest is a bit chilly I have expected it to be like in Southeast Asia, like super warm. It's warm, but it's refreshing warm. And the color of the water is just so amazing. It's green, it's blue, it's everything. Look. hungry trying to find a place with vegetarian food but well not even vegan vegetarian but here it's just meat and fish yeah we will see <laughs> now we found a vegetarian snack yummy after blue bay we now reached Pointe Desny 
the Blue Bay area is very nice, very scenic. We had some nice food, but we wanted to have a quieter feeling on the beach. So we just parked the car here and go to one spot that is accessible if you are not living on the beach because the public beaches here are rare there's only one access to the beach and we go down there if you come to the beach look at this sign difficult to read but like this you find the beach started raining <laughs> here in the back you see la ile aigrette this is where the very old turtles can still be visited it's a national park so yeah i think we just look for a spot and see if we just jump in the water and swim while it's raining if you expect more water then i'm sorry for <laughs> in the water oh, oh. Oh. The following day it was time to explore the city itself. We crossed over a nice inlay and yeah, just enjoyed the hustle and bustle of this small city. We had some nice vegan food. We walked around the waterfront which is really really beautiful and amazing. Lots of space to walk, to chill, to enjoy the views talked to some locals and finally we also visited a market. Probably the most annoying sound of an ice cream vendor ever.
here we come to our accommodation. It's the Orient Guest House. It's very, very simple, but really good value for money. And here in front there, it's our little car, which is really a shitty car, but also this one was really cheap. Yeah, and our room is there. And we will now show you the view we have. finally leave this wonderful place I will give you a quick room tour we are on the second floor with this amazing view you see the reef far in the distance uh, the waves breaking the Il Egret it's really really nice and we are on the second floor as I said and we have a nice sitting area overlooking the ocean and when you come in it's pretty pretty basic you have a double bed which was quite okay you have some storage for your luggage and it's very bright you have the windows out overlooking the ocean so we woke up having this beautiful view and then there is a desk area with two chairs and a simple bathroom and a shower. The only issue here was that there are a lot of ants. It's a non aircon room, it was super cheap, but it was really clean. And people are very, very nice here. So, overall, we liked our stay here. It's just that the ants were everywhere, even in the bed. And the hot water in the shower was sometimes working. Most of the times we had a cold shower, which is fine with the temperatures here, but to keep that in mind. I will put the link of the accommodation down there, so if you want to check it out, it's pretty okay if you're on a budget and we can recommend it. Did you like our time in this house? Then press all the buttons, subscribe to the channel and see you in the next one. Ha, ha, ha.